What's up guys, Dani Abroad here and today I'm going to be talking about the reason why foreigners choose to study in India and why particularly I chose to study here in India and I'm going to be involving one of my friends, Batin Muhombo, I'm sure you know him because most of you, I think some of you follow him. So I'm going to be inviting him and talk about the reasons why he chose to study here in India. But the main emphasis of this video was to bust the myth that the reason why Africans come study here is because uh, we don't have universities in Africa or well, like uh, more developed universities or something that universities that give uh, better quality education. That's not true. Uh, like someone commented on one of my videos and was telling me like, oh, why did you come study here? Don't you have... Uh, good universities in africa like most of the people that's what they ask me but that's not true we have uh, quality universities good universities uh, but we come here for different reasons and most of the times it's to discover new cultures and make new friends well one of the reasons why i think foreigners come to study here in india especially africans and especially me it's one of the reasons, the major reason, is to escape our helicopter parents. You know, like finding your parents are hovering over you, uh, asking you about your studies every time. So, like, you find you need to escape away from them and uh, go to other places. So, in order for you to grow and know who you are, discover yourself. So, most of us, like, they, we have this need of finding and discovering ourselves and grow and to know who we are. So you find like that's one of the reasons why you choose to come here. And another reason why I chose to come and study here in India is because India was a big country with a lot of diversity and culture. And I'm a person who is who likes to read about culture and all how it influences stuff like the world and stuff. So so before I came here, I actually knew that I wanted to start a YouTube channel and. Uh, discover what I had to discover and travel so like traveling was one of my main focus why I wanted to study abroad and choosing India it was a big thing for me actually considered I uh, was going to China but I decided to come here first so that maybe other countries can come later and uh, do this I hear here I do like pharmacy and India is one of the best countries in you know uh, medicine and stuff so I decided to exploit this opportunity study medicine here and then also travel around and learn what I have to learn and to BCC I've learned a lot in my travels and I'm still discovering India and well as I'm still doing this in future I'll be doing more vlogs rather than uh, sitting here in one room and talking about India in my studio so basically yeah, I think some of you subscribed to my channel before. I know that I do. I started with vlogs, but as of quarantine and lockdowns, I've not been able to travel, and I'm basically waiting for this quarantine to sort of end, then I can start traveling. So let me jump into where I asked Batin about one of the reasons why he came here, so that you can get a different perspective view of why other people would choose to come and study here, other foreigners. So right now I'm here with Betin and he's going to tell you one of his reasons why he came to study here in India. I have so many. <laughs> <laughs> so what are the many reasons or one or two or three, um, however you can give. How yeah, many, yeah. Uh, like, like why you came to study here in India. Hmm. My choice of coming in India was based on like what other people told me. I basically didn't want to come to India because like I was not interested in India before. Yeah. So I didn't want to come to India. Yeah. So other people interested me in India, but it was not my first choice. And when I left my country to go and study in another country first before coming to India, yeah. the only reason was that I wanted to study in English. Oh. Like in my country, I speak French. And I was kind of that obsessed to English. Like I was seeing as if the world of English goes faster. So I wanted, <laughs> yeah, I wanted, I remember putting pressure on my parents. Like I went just in English school, in English school. And in my country, the university, which was organizing English stuff, they didn't have engineering, which I wanted to do. So I had to go in another country and I decided to go in, in, in Tanzania. But yeah. then, okay, even Tanzania was not the first country which I tried. I tried first Kenya and then Tanzania later on. But then when I reached Tanzania, when I was really done with everything, when I was almost at the time to start school, they told me that I'm late. I should wait for next year. That's when someone proposed me, why can't you go to China or India? And I said, okay, it's fine. So let me try. And then 
I was even scared because you know, <laughs> India it's, it, it's a totally different world. I don't have yeah. anything I know there, but at least in Africa there were universities which, which uh, like I, like it's still Africa, it's still my place. So even if I don't speak English and I went in countries where they speak English, but at least I kind of feel that you know it's still home. Yeah. But you know, India it's really far away. Then I remember what I just did. I just uh, took. Uh, on Google, universities which organize biomedical engineering in China and in India, I created one email, I copy all their emails, I create one email, I send to all of them, and then I got one which replied to me first, and then I applied and everything was done like that. So I see the reasons why you came to study here, basically it was because of, uh, I wanted to study in an English program. Yeah, I just wanted an English, an English oh. country, but uh, India was not my first choice place to go. Oh, so mm -hmm. like... So when India became like a, a, a choice for you to come here, like, were there like some other reasons, like maybe you wanted to Not discover like culture and okay. maybe travel? Honestly, as I yeah. said, I didn't like India before. So my only reason was coming here was just to study. I didn't have any plan of saying that I will go there and I will love the culture. Like it came later on when I was already here to fall okay. in love with the Indian culture, but I didn't have that behind my mind. I even remember like, like I was just careless about India, and I remember even the day before coming at the airport, I didn't know the name of the city <laughs> where I was going. That's when they when they asked me which city are you going in, I didn't know. Like I had to check, like because it, it was like I know the the address was on the letter on the yeah. on the offer letter. I had to check again down Vadodra Vadodra Gujarat. That I remember that's what I used to say I, I, Vadodra Gujarat. And I know, but, I, and they don't call it Vadodra. That's yeah, like, exactly. I, I yeah. remember I was tell people at the airport. I'm yeah, going to Vadodra. Vadodra uh, yeah. <laughs> then I check. You know, be like Vadodra. Ah, 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 like, you you know, know, most people knows when it's India, it's Delhi or Mumbai. So yeah. when you speak of Vadodra, it's kind of nobody knows that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, th that was the same thing which I had. Like I was just not interested in India. So oh. I didn't have any plan behind my mind of I'm going in India for this and that. I just knew only studies. But of okay. course I was open to what what you did there, then we'll live with it. Well, thank you for answering my question and let's get back to our video. Well, that was a piece from Batin and I guess uh you get some point in his own point of view. Like he says that he came to study here in India because of the English medium and some universities in Africa don't teach an English medium because uh, different countries were colonized by different uh, colonial powers. Like uh, in my country, basically, I was colonized by the British, so we speak English. So the reasons why I came here, it wasn't because uh, India was speaking, like uh, was teaching an English medium. Also, my country, they teach in an English medium. But you see, to but in this point, he came here because India was teaching like in English medium which in this country the universities didn't have so well I hope you learned from this video basically busting the myth that Africans come study here because they don't have uh, good universities that's not true well I hope you enjoyed the video see you next time subscribe film merengue see you next time